In the vast silence of space, it's often said that no one can hear you scream. But while sound waves can't travel in a vacuum, space has its own way of speaking to us. There are plenty of other kinds of waves. As I was researching this month's videos, I stumbled across a new audio recording of Earth that I hadn't heard before. And since my last video about the sound of Earth from space was enjoyed by so many, I thought I'd make a quick update video about this latest recording, giving you a fresh perspective on how the space around our home planet sounds. You're watching V101 Space. My name's Rob, and we're on the final stretch to a million subscribers. If you love space and want to be a part of this incredible journey, hit that subscribe button and let's reach that milestone together. Before we listen to the recording, let me quickly tell you what it is. In August 2024, the European Space Agency's Jupiter Icy Moons Explorer, or JUICE spacecraft, made a close flyby of Earth, passing just 6,840 kilometers from our planet. While its main goal was to adjust its trajectory for its future journey to Jupiter, this close approach also gave scientists the chance to activate some of the onboard instruments. And one of the instruments activated was the Radio and Plasma Wave Investigation, which is designed to measure radio emissions and plasma environments when it arrives at the Jupiter system in 2031. But as JUICE flew past Earth, it captured radio waves emitted by our planet and the Sun. Now these radio waves aren't something we can hear in their raw form, but they do tell us a story about Earth's interaction with space. When the data is transformed into sound we can hear, it reveals the almost eerie signals that surround our planet that are usually invisible to us. So let's now listen to this bizarre recording, and if you want to find out more about the sounds, then stick around to the end, as I will explain in more detail what you're about to hear. But the main thing, as you listen, keep in mind that this is not just a random sound effect. It's a reflection of the interaction between Earth and the cosmos. As you can see on the spectrogram on the screen, the pattern of the signal is quite dynamic, fluctuating in distinct peaks and valleys. Each fluctuation represents a burst or change in radio frequency. These patterns correspond directly to the energy and movement of electrons around Earth's magnetic field. The amplitude of these waves increases as the auroras become more active, creating those powerful, crackling bursts of energy. At the beginning of the recording, you'll hear the powerful bursts of Earth's auroras, the northern and southern lights. These are caused by charged particles from the sun interacting with Earth's magnetic field, creating these distinct, almost eerie sounds. As juice passed closest to Earth, in the middle you'll notice a rising and falling tone. This represents the radio emissions from electrons around our planet. The shift in pitch reflects the movement of the spacecraft through this dynamic environment, revealing the invisible forces that surround the Earth. 
And finally, at the end, you'll hear a series of sharp pew noises. These are radio bursts produced by electrons flying from the sun. Another reminder of our sun's powerful influence, even across vast distances. When I listen to audio clips like this, it almost makes me think I'm underwater, like Earth is drifting beneath the waves of an ocean we can't see. And in a way, that isn't all that far from the truth. Space is filled with energy streaming in all directions, and we're only beginning to tune into it. Without spacecraft like JUICE, we'd never be able to hear these invisible signals, a wavelength our eyes or ears can't pick up. JUICE is literally giving us a glimpse into a hidden realm, one that's always been there, just beyond the reach of our senses. If you've made it this far, thank you. But did you know that over 86% of people who watch my videos aren't subscribed? And if you're still here, then you're exactly the kind of person I make these videos for. V101 Space is closing in on 1 million subscribers. And if you've enjoyed this journey through the cosmos, I would love for you to be a part of that moment. So please do hit the subscribe button, it really helps more than you know. And if you want to go one step further and help support the channel directly, you can become a V101 member or patron. The links are in the description. It keeps this project going and gives you some nice perks too, including your name at the end of each video and things like behind the scenes access and exclusive content. Either way, thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.